Speaking of new trailers, the latest spot for the upcoming Jesse Eisenberg and Kristen Stewart film, American Ultra, has hit the web. American Ultra centers on Mike, played by Jesse Eisenberg, a seemingly hapless and unmotivated stoner whose small-town life with his live-in girlfriend Phoebe, played by Kristen Stewart, is suddenly turned upside down. Unbeknownst to him, Mike is actually a highly trained, lethal sleeper agent. In the blink of an eye, as his secret past comes back to haunt him, Mike is thrust into the middle of a deadly government operation and is forced to summon and his inner action hero in order to survive. Schnepp, what do you think of the American Ultra Spot? Um, this new trailer was fun. It, some of, it, to be honest with you, it felt like there was a little bit of a weird tone shifting going on back and forth. The Topher Grace, uh, the Topher Grace scenes just felt too, like I'm in an action comedy, and then some of the other scenes felt like, uh, oh, okay, it's Jesse Eisenberg doing like his kind of uh, the zombie land thing. Mm-hmm. So. Um, you know, I know the script uh, by Max Landis will probably be really fun and weird, but right now I just I, I'm kind of like stuck in the middle somewhere. Like I, I'm looking forward to seeing it, but the trailer didn't really do anything for me. I, this is a weird trailer yeah. for me because I watched the trailer because two things happen. I watch the trailer, I'm like, this isn't a very good trailer. Yeah. Yet I'm oddly interested in seeing this movie, mm-hmm. even though I hated their last movie together. Uh, what was it, Adventureland? Adventureland? I hated that movie. I thought it was just awful and it feels like it's a little bit of a poor man's long kiss good night you remember that yes uh, with that, the, yes totally that was a great movie. samuel jackson was so good in that um that was a wonderful movie so it's weird i don't like the trailer i don't think it's well put together you're right about the toe for grace stuff feeling very awkward and and whatever and yet it i, I finished watching the trailer going yeah, I got to see that. I don't know how that works, but that's the way it is. Did you guys see the first trailer? Yeah. Yes. I loved the first trailer, and I thought it's it, it's like Pineapple Express meets Born Identity. Mm. Um, it's so <laughs> it's, it's, a good comparison. it's bizarre, and I actually and Chris, uh, Kristen Kristen Stewart the last couple of performances she's been getting away from that Twilight thing, and yeah. she certainly did it with Still Alice, and she yes and she did the last yeah. movie she's I can't remember the name of it, but she's she's getting away from that, and in this she's still playing kind of like the kind of mopey stoner, but I think there's going to be a little bit more to it, and it's going to have to call on her to do that in this type of vibe but it's what you said Schnepp is the script by Landis that I'm that, that guy he, he's quirky he's out of his mind and I want to see everything he writes because you're going to get different yeah. and this is what this movie looks like to me it looks different I agree with you 100% that the Topher Grace stuff you couldn't have said it better that it looks like he's like hey I'm in an action comedy movie right. check me out <laughs> I'm over explaining <laughs> stuff yeah, yeah, and weird hand gesticulations. I look like Mark <laughs> Ellis um, and then they're gonna do this and ride around and do this yeah, you're right. like what movie is he but, in but I, still, but I still really like the trailer because I think that this is the perfect combination for all this quirky weirdness um, and it's different and I'm looking I want to get some more different yeah. movies and I think this is a movie that could do that yeah I, I, like I said I it's, it's really weird to me I'm yeah. oddly on board 